Welcome back to the Midnight Who Show, and tonight, as you can see in front of me, is a Doctor Who magazine with the brand new logo, which does look quite cool. As you can tell, David Tennant is the Doctor. Yes, this is the future, as the quote says. But yeah, it's been a whole month since the 13th Doctor regenerated into the new Doctor, who is very familiar to a few Whovians out there, who is quite familiar to the Doctor Who community. It's definitely quite a crazy thing to think that we actually have David Tennant playing a whole new incarnation of the Doctor. I'm really excited to see what those three specials will be like next November. And of course, come on, I'm really excited for Shuti Gatwa. You know, they just announced his new companion, Ruby Tuesday, which is definitely a very Russell T. Davis sounding name, I'm not going to lie. And I'm really excited to see what the 14th series of Doctor Who is going to be like in 2024. But as you can probably tell by what I just said, it is a long wait till those adventures. But luckily, to hold us fans over, Doctor Who magazine has, as you can know right in this corner, the first adventure for the 14th Doctor. Yes, in comic form. Now what's really cool about this, because I don't want to show too much of the comic, because I want you guys to actually read this one yourself, and I don't want to give too much away. But as you can see, it is, see right here, it is a 13-part comic that will run just one hour of this new Doctor's life. And you can probably guess, yes, the Daleks are involved. But yes, the art of this comic is really good. I really enjoy it. Of course, it is written by Alan Barnes. And there's the art colors lettering editor of it. But yeah, this is a great start to this new 13-part run. It just means you're going to have to buy Doctor Who magazine for the next year to see how the story unfolds. But I'm going to lie, it's a pretty good start. I really just like how it just starts. You know, the 14th Doctor, no weird side effects from the regeneration. He's just right onto the adventure, answering this distress call, which leads him to 1966, where the World Cup is happening. And he soon finds out that the Daleks are involved. But you also find some aliens in the stands. <laughs> but yes, this is a great start. I would highly recommend picking this issue up just for the sheer fact that it is the very first official cover of the 14th Doctor. But yeah, I cannot wait to see how this unfolds in the next year. I'm really excited. But just a little, it's nice having a little appetizer for the 14th Doctor's adventures and it's gonna be interesting to see how this whole three specials unfold next year because i'm really excited now did you pick up the latest doctor who magazine and let me know your thoughts on this very first adventure for the 14th doctor in the comments below and this is also just a really great magazine just because you know it has a little bit about the regeneration and this is a really cool kind of information and i still think I think, Russell, there's that controversy online, which I'm not going to really talk about with the regeneration. But yeah, it's just a really cool little insight into that regeneration. And of course, insight into the comic and some really cool things they would expect from a Doctor Who magazine. Well, that's it for tonight. Really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next video.